Hello, and welcome to TechBoost TV. I'm Jaime, and today I'm going to show you how to install a hard drive and a solid state drive into the Dell T5500 workstation. Before beginning, we recommend checking with the manufacturer and ensuring the latest firmware is installed. For this installation, you may need a small Phillips head screwdriver for the drive converter. Please check out the quick spec link in the description below to learn more about hard drive compatibility for the T5500. Also check the manufacturer's system manual and comply with their recommended safety instructions. To begin, ensure your computer is powered off and the power cord is unplugged. Next, press and hold the power button until the light shuts off to ensure there is no residual power remaining. To open the system, slide the top latch back and the panel will pop out. Remove the panel and set the system on its side to have better access to the interior. Lift up the two tabs for each hard drive bay you wish to use. Place the hard drive in by first aligning two of the pins on the holes of the hard drive, and then aligning the remaining two. Once properly mounted, the hard drive will be flush and secure. Connect the data and power cables to finish installation. Repeat this process if needed for the second drive. If you are installing a solid state drive, also known as an SSD, the process is the same, except that you will need a drive bay converter. Simply mount the 2.5 inch SSD into the drive converter as shown. Once the SSD is installed, the rest of the process is the same. Now that your chosen drive is installed, reattach the panel and you are done. Please check out our how-to videos covering processor, memory, and other component installation for this and other systems. If you have found this helpful, please hit the like and subscribe buttons below. We welcome suggestions on how to make these more useful, so please don't be shy with requesting additional content.